Your coworkers are constantly flying all over the place and you're left wondering, how do they have so much money? Well, they probably don't. They just utilize tried and true methods to find the best deals. Not to worry though, I'm here to show you how to find cheap flights with a few clicks. Now, I quickly want to mention that flights have dynamic pricing, which means that websites can adjust current pricing based on your information, like the location you're searching from. Of course, there are more factors like the destination's popularity or even the economic status of the country you're from. This sounds kind of scummy, right? It's mostly done to give every country a fair chance. Your buying power living in New York will probably be way higher than someone living in Granada. So how do we take advantage of this? To do so, we need to first sort of trick the website into thinking we're from somewhere else. To be clear, it's not always possible to do so. There are a lot of ways these sites get your location, including geolocation tracking and Wi-Fi location. So don't be signed in and use incognito mode while searching. Well, that's the first step. And most of the time, it's not enough. Our chances to find cheap flights increase with the help of a VPN. In general, I recommend always using a VPN for traveling and ticket searches. It masks your IP address and encrypts your data so airlines can't collect info to increase the price. Now let me show you exactly how to use a VPN for flight tickets. First, search for desired destination prices without a VPN to jot down what you're offered. It's easier if you take notes or screenshots for comparison later on. Next up, install the VPN on your computer or phone. There's a plethora of good options out there, but for the best option, NordVPN for cheap flights is ideal. The app offers top security measures, is very user-friendly, and includes a bunch of super useful features. What's most important for us though, is the coverage. NordVPN has over 6,000 servers in 111 countries, so you'll have lots of locations to search for the cheapest flight tickets. So be sure to use the QR code on screen, which will make a subscription to NordVPN even more affordable. Next, we need to clean your device from any traces of previous searches. To do so, you'll need to clear your cache, delete cookies, and wipe your browsing history. This can differ from browser to browser, but Chrome has a neat button called Clear Browsing Data that streamlines this process. Keep in mind that you need to repeat this step every time you want to search for a new flight. You can also try to use incognito or private modes for this, but this approach might not always work. So, we're ready to search for cheap flights with NordVPN. All we have to do is pick a server. You can either type in the country to the list or, my personal favorite, use the server map. This functionality is the reason I think NordVPN is one of the best VPN for travel options on the market. Not only is it more comfortable and visually pleasing, but it also makes it way easier to see all the locations available. Okay, for this scenario, let's say I wanna to travel to Brazil. I will pick a server there. It'll check the exact same route that I looked for before connecting to the server so that I can really see the difference buying cheap flights with NordVPN makes. Compare these prices with the ones you got in the initial search. And remember to clear your data. It only takes a tiny bit of unclear data for the airlines to eagerly jack up the flight prices. Finally, you'll need to do a worldwide search, connecting to different countries and seeing what prices they offer. Connect to a country with a developing currency, as these tend to have cheaper rates. Some of the places I've had the most success in are Mexico, Moldova, and the Philippines. Other ways to get cheap flights include checking the airline's home country, since they occasionally offer discounted rates. For Turkish airlines, connect to a Turkish server. Or for Air Canada, try one in, well, Canada. I personally had the most success when connecting to my destination server. So if I'm flying to Spain, well, you get the gist by this point, no need for repetition. But you know what is needed? A like on this video and subscription to the channel. Thanks in advance. Oh, and when it comes to NordVPN, it's not only helpful for answering the how to find cheap flights question. A VPN provides a lot more while traveling too. For example, connecting to public Wi-Fi is a serious risk. A VPN encrypts your network connection to guarantee that third-party snoopers cannot do damage. Plus, it's super helpful while traveling outside the country to be able to connect to a local server and behave as though you're still there. Since some services like online banking or streaming are sensitive to location changes, this removes that headache. And of course, it helps you protect your online privacy and in NordVPN's case, comes with an anti-malware tool included. Anyway, I'm leaving an exclusive NordVPN discount on the screen right now. If you found this video helpful, please don't hesitate to drop a comment down below. Take care and enjoy your travels.